<laughs> What's up, YouTube? Let's invest in some Pokemon. Come on. What's up everybody, my name's Kyle, and today I'm gonna to teach you how to make buko bucks selling Pokemon cards. <laughs> so the Pokemon market can be pretty tricky. Kinda of like when you're pitted in sort of a gnarly nine foot barrel and there's a thick crowd of surfers around. But don't worry, I'm here to make sure that you don't wipe out. Step one, checking the surf report. Success in any investment is built on a strong foundation of solid research. So be sure not to bail out when it comes to this step. Step two, finding extra moolah. Now that you've done your research, you'll have to get your hands on some extra cash. And if you're not slanging sandwiches at Subway anymore, you'll have to find another way to get some extra moolah. <laughs> Credit cards and personal loans are two ways to get cash fast. Or you could even take a more entrepreneur style like my buddy Carlos. Pikachu, I choose you. Pika, pika. Choosing where to invest is like choosing the perfect wave. There's a sea of opportunity out there, but it's up to you to find the right one. Now, although this task seems daunting at first, don't worry, because I'm here to break it down Barney style for you dudes. <laughs> Pokemon investments can be broken down into three different categories. Raw, sealed, and graded, otherwise known as slabbed. Due to their ability to be sourced at a low price, raw cards make a great entry point for any young investor. Although not as easily as sourceable, sealed product holds great value over the long term. It also carries the least amount of risk out of all three options. <laughs> and last but certainly not least, slabs. These little pricey pieces of plastic can make you buco bucks and the Warren Buffett of the sea. Oh yeah. Step 4. Getting the tendies. Ow. Now that you've built your portfolio, it's time to sell those puppies. There are many different sites to consider when selling your cards. For example, Instagram, Craigslist, or my personal fave, eBay. Today, I'm going to be using eBay to show you how to list a card. First, you're going to want to upload a picture of the card you wish to sell. I took the liberty of taking some pictures earlier today. Next, go and hide and type in a cool name. After that's finished, go ahead and go down to the pricing section. Type in your price. <laughs> nice. Lastly, scroll down to listing ad right and make sure it's set to 100 for maximum viewership. And you're done. Great job, you successfully listed your first car. Step five, ride the wave. Well, there you have it. Now that you have a prodigious understanding of how to make money in the Pokemon market, it's time to hang 10 and ride those waves. If you enjoyed this content, like and subscribe for more. And until next time, my dudes, peace out.